Hey guys, and today we're going to be playing Octane, which is the second level in the second world in Impossible Game 2. We're going to be doing a practice run and then playing it in normal mode. So this is introduces a gun, which basically it just shoots obstacles out of the way. Like, the second... This might be without checkpoints. No, it's a check. This second section is quite annoying because that one's the only fake gun that you don't need. Because when you have the gun, you can't jump, and it needs you to jump there, so it's a fake. And then there's this really annoying timing here, and it's the hardest timing in the level. And then it also has these gears that move to the music instead of when you jump. Oh, I missed that. That's the first time I missed that timing. I already tried to do this as... I already tried to film this once, but I accidentally stopped the recording, so... I'm doing that too late, I think. Because, yeah, when I practiced before the first filming, I never died to it. And during the first filming, I never died to it. I, was, I meant to keep doing the first filming, but I accidentally stopped it and... So I just deleted it. This section is very easy. On my first attempt, after practice, I got to 80%. And then like 10 attempts later, I got to like 82 as well. So, you, you have to hold on to it. There, you have to shoot the spiky guy so you can bounce on it. Oh. So yeah, this part's very easy. The only annoying part is the post drop around 80 and the pre drop until like 20 5 probably and then after that it's easy shoot jump shoot jump jump shoot Here, in the first filming, I accidentally missed a gun in the second. In the boss fight section, I just passed, but you can still do it, but it's easy. So this post drop is what I died to twice. Here you have to shoot it, then time that. And that's a, that's a mini time, and that's what I died to as well. See, that part's annoying. This part is easily chokeable. Oh, I missed the shot. And it's the final showdown. Shoot. There. New best on practice. Let's go. I'll try it without practice. Let's see how. I should be able to beat it quickly. So the thing about these levels is that there isn't really a drop because there's no speed changes like i would consider think different has a drop because of all the moving platforms that sing to the music and indestructible because it the boss starts moving super fast as the music speeds up this doesn't really have a, like the gameplay doesn't really get more intense well, you're, you're doing more, but it's not really harder. It's probably easier. Like, it would, if it was in geometry, that's just a really benefit from a speed change. And then, also, like, this geometry dash has more condensed difficulty. Like, these levels are quite long compared to geometry dash main levels. For there, you have to shoot the spiky guy so you can bounce on the normal guy. Oh, come on. Just when I say about how easy the drop is, I die to it. I should have made it to the post drop after that. I don't know. Normally, the pre drops is 0 to 20. The drop is like 20 to 80 or 20 to 70. And the post drop is... That to a hundred. Ah, 
Ugh. I keep messing up that timing for no reason. I don't know why I'm messing it up. I just feel like clicking early. Yeah. Why? That section in between the first and second checkpoint is very difficult. It's the hardest part of the level. And I don't know why. Again, the timing. Next video, I'm gonna be doing, like, making a challenge, either a timings challenge or a triple spike challenge. So then I can get better with it, and I don't wanna make a whole level again. If I do, I'll probably make a memory level, because I wanna see what that would look like while not having all the bonus features from the stuff you have to pay for. If I can make it past 20%, I should be fine. More notably, this timing. Oh, I died to the fake. Okay, if I just focus, I should be able to beat it. Just pass the timing. Yes, okay. No! I died to the second timing. Okay, if I can pass the timing, I should be fine. Jump time, yes. I should have beaten this level sooner. Like, this video's gonna be one of the longer level completions recently. Because before the recent ones, I just practiced a lot and then I beat the level really quickly. But I wanna show the difficult parts, like, they don't seem difficult if I play them after I practice them a lot. There we go. This should be it. And for some, I'll be quite disappointed. And I died to him. This is gonna be like the thing different one where I just keep trying to film it and I'm unsuccessful because of annoying section in the level. Yes. Okay, I'm more consistent with that timing now. But it's hard because you're falling. When something else is falling, it's easy, like at the end. In the final 
difficult part. It's easier when something else is falling. Okay, this should be it. Hold on to it. Shoot, shoot. Go. Please. And I almost just died to that. I'm very lucky. I'm just going to be very cautious with when I use the gun. I don't want to shoot it too early and have it end my run because I shot it too early. Post drop, let's go. I cannot believe I just did that. That was very lucky. Yes, let's go. So yeah, guys, that was Octane, 100%. That was good. So next time we're going to be doing a creation video, then we're going to be breathed. So thanks for watching, and bye, yee, 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 yee.